Okay, this time we're going to do a move with drag and drop. We're going to move these words up beside the sentence they belong with. So I'm going to select the first one, false, because this one here, you can always open a Word file even if that file didn't have an extension. You know, you might not be able to open it if it doesn't have an extension. Sometimes Windows may recognize it, depending but really we always want to have an extension because it will have trouble knowing what type of file it is. So once this is selected, uh, you can select with a double click and then you click and hold the left mouse button and you drag it here. You release the left mouse button at this when the insertion point is here. Now notice you always get uh, this little mini toolbar and this little icon here. It's waiting to see if you want to further filter these choices. If you don't, you can just press escape and it will disappear. Okay, only one document is open. If you click file close, the whole application should not close. Although I've seen it happen, but it should not. It's when you do the X on the whole program or application that the whole application will shut down. So we're going to move false over here and press escape and come over here. The save icon in the quick access bar that looks like a floppy disk up here. Is it the save or save as? It's, it's definitely the save command, not the save as command. So that is false. The title bar always shows the name of the document here at the very top bar here. So that is true. And bring it over here. And again, if you don't like that little icon that shows, just press escape. And the last one is true. File names always have extensions.